Hey everyone, it's me, Colin. Welcome to my channel. What's going on, you guys? So today I'm doing a video that I've literally watched every single one of. I'm doing my dorm room haul video. And so for those who don't know, I'm going to Christian Brothers University in the fall. It's right here in Memphis, so I'm staying local. However, I'm going to be living in a dorm, which is exciting. I want that whole genuine like dorm college life experience. So I'm so excited for it. It's like 30 minutes away from here anyway. So it's kind of like I'm I'm leaving town, I'm getting away a little bit. So I'm super excited for it. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys everything that I bought and I bought a lot of stuff. I kind of went all out. So um, hopefully I don't regret that. It was a big financial decision. But today I'm gonna show y'all all I bought today. So if you guys wanna keep on watching and see what I got keep on watching. Um, it's weird. Just watch. All right, now for this video today, I'm going to be showing you guys basically in kind of sections, more like appliances, kind of like necessary type items, electronics, more storage items, and then all the decor items, which I am super excited for. It's like my favorite part. And so I'm going to show y'all what I have. All right, now first thing in appliances I have is this Keurig right here, this bad boy. And I am so excited that I finally got my own Keurig. I drink a bunch of coffee like every day i probably at least have one cup a day two cups if i'm really feeling it and so i'm really excited to finally get a keurig of my own to have i actually did buy one already however this one came from my mom's friend it was free she barely used it and i was like if it's free that's perfect i know you'd save money and i had more money to buy other things with it so it was just perfect trip. all right so the next thing i bought is actually this iron right here when i was watching a lot of haul videos i saw a lot of people did not buy irons probably bought steamers or and then it just get an iron at all. But thing is, I need my own personal iron because I iron a lot. I'm ironing everything. I'm that like type of person who even irons their, <laughs> their t-shirts. So like I really am desperate need of an iron. And this one was about $23. I got off like Amazon. Now the next thing I got was this printer right here, this HP wireless printer. And I knew I was gonna need the printer. I'm the type of person who's a lot of things like last minute. So a printer was really good for me. I think I got it for, let me check the price. I know I got it from Walmart. I bought it online and it was about $40. So it's actually really good for a printer. It, and I hope it's just the job. I don't need anything like super fancy, but if I need to print a paper out at like 3 a.m. in the morning, which I've done so many times in school, then this will come in perfect helps. And then the next thing I got was actually this little vacuum right here. It's a Eureka vacuum. It's kind of hard to fit in the frame. I'm gonna do like close-ups of everything. I don't know what this is, but it's this Eureka vacuum right here. It's kind of like the two-in-one where you can like disconnect it and just have like this part of it right there. And so I once again, I know I need a vacuum because I do have a rug. I'll show y'all that later. But at the same time, just like cleaning everything, being easy with it. We don't have people that's gonna like clean our rooms or clean our bathrooms or anything, so I wanna make sure I have like good cleaning supplies, something that I can use to easily get things clean. Plus cleaning a carpet with a rug, cleaning a rug <laughs> with a broom is actually near impossible. I've done it at work and it's not fun. So the vacuum was about $30, once again, got it from Amazon. All right, so the next thing for um, appliances is actually my microwave, which is too big to show on camera. I'll do a close up of it. But um, Christian Brothers, they don't give you a microwave or do they give you uh, um, a little refrigerator, at least in my um, dorms they don't. So I did buy myself one I got from Walmart as well. I bought it online, free to and shipping. It was perfect and it was about $45, which I guess, I mean, when you buy things like this, you really don't know how much you pay for like a little microwave. So it's kind of nice, it's like a stainless steel on it. All right, so the next thing I got, which every dorm room needs, is a mattress topper. It's really not aesthetically pleasing at all, but I actually got it online at Wayfair. It was about 50 or so dollars. I think it was like on sale for 200, so hopefully that means it's a quality mattress topper. But um, yeah, it's, everyone needs one. I think it's like a three inch memory foam slash gel mattress topper, which hopefully comes in handy because I, if it's not comfortable, I just can't see. All right, so now we're gonna move on to more home things, not decor yet, but just things you need like, sheets and everything, towels and whatnot. And the first thing I did get was my ironing board. I got it from Walmart, as y'all can see. And I wanna check the price. It was actually really inexpensive. Yeah, it was like 750. 
at um, Walmart. It's kind of like one of those small ones, which can perfectly like go on top of the bed and just iron. So putting it up is really easy. It's like literally like three feet tall, so it's perfect. And then next, I did get my Brita water filter right here. And so a lot of people use it, a lot of people don't. I knew I wanted to at least try <laughs> to use the whole Brita water filter thing. It was $19. I got it from Walmart online as well. Because things I've tried already not to be too many water bottles, like plastic water bottles, but I fell at it. So in college, I want to get better at it. And then the next thing I have is this right here. It's really just a laundry bag. It says pinch me on it, and it's pretty big, as y'all can see. It was $10 from Ross. Um, they had a lot of good ones, and I really want like a bag bag. Because things I'm gonna come home and do laundry anyway. Just doing laundry and comfort your home comfort of your home is better in my opinion so I'll be coming home to do laundry and I can just throw everything in there and I feel like it saves space like I feel like everything else I want everything to like save as much space as I can you know every dorm room needs is going to need a mattress cover or mattress protector so basically I think once I get my, my um um, mattress topper on top of it. I'll put this over it, and like I said, it just protects the mattress. They're, they're dirty. A lot of people have loved on them. Mine was also ten dollars from um, Ross. All right, and then right here, um, I just really just got a sheet set from Bed Bath and Beyond. I know these were like ten dollars, which was crazy. And I got them in gray, and actually these are my extra sheets. So don't want to kill me, like. Usually you do want to like get good sheets for ones you sleep on all the time, but these are kind of like extra sheets. Like if I really just need to like wash stuff, I can put sheets on the bed or uh, wash my good sheet. And now we get into towels and stuff. I got my towels from Ross. And these are my bath towels. They were literally five dollars, and I got a pack of six of them, so they were great in a dark gray. And then I got a bunch of these big dry off towels from Ross as well, and they are so soft. I think the hotel or whatever you know like a bunch of random brands and i think these are about seven dollars a piece and i'm super excited for these it makes me like want to lie down like go to sleep so i just thought those were real fun and then i got this comforter from bed bath and beyond which i was super excited about i want to say this was on sale for sixty dollars actually i think it's like originally 90 but it has this really cool print or so on it and i was loving it i've always had a history as y'all can see in the background with right comforters, it's always something that I've always done, so I didn't have to do this one. And so for $60, it gets you the comforter, the two um, shams, and then a four-piece sheet set, which is good. They're like sharp sheets, which, if y'all see the bag right there, which I already love. I love the stripes and the stripe sheets <laughs> of it all, and so it's super cozy and super comfortable and so I did get a full in that which I'm not mad about because the thing is sheets will go over better because I don't have the mattress topper and everything on it and also I don't mind a big comfort I feel like a big comfort is almost like a knee all right and then of course because you know storage is limited in the dorm rooms I did get me a little drawer set I'm gonna have to put that in there because it's so big to show y'all that I got from Bed Bath & Beyond and it was actually only $20 so it's really nice it's gray as well a whole bunch of gray going on, but I knew that I needed one, and that is Matthew you know, I had my back on it. And then, for some more storage, I got this right here. It's a Lexington three-tier rolling cart from Michael's. Michael's is my favorite store, y'all will definitely see in a second. And so, it's matte black, which I love. I've already taken it out and built it, so that's why I don't have it in the frame. But this is it right here. And I think, originally, they're like $60, but they have them like permanently on sale for $30. But I ordered mine online, and if y'all do like the little honey add-on to your Google browser, it took off like $5 for me, so I even got like a better deal on it. So I loved it, picked it up the next day in store. We were good to go. This is the last thing I got from like really home thingies. If y'all don't know, it's really just an adjustable closet extender. So basically it creates a whole nother rack in your closet, which I am very excited for because the thing is, I have a bunch of clothes and I tend to overpack, so. I think this will come very much in handy. It was $10 at Target. All right, and so now it's time for my favorite part of the video, which is actually decor. And for this um, kind of plan for my room, I want to go less farm, more kind of boho type, um, mid-century modern type of thing. So, all right, so the first thing I did get was actually this huge rug 
from um, Ross as well. It was actually about $15 and has this really nice design on it. And so for the rug, it's probably gonna go between either both of our beds, you know, me and our roommate, or it's gonna go more to my bed, just so I have somewhere to step when I get out of bed. All right, and the next thing I got was actually this Pro from Ikea. It was about $5, and so the second I saw it, I knew I had to have it, because $5 for a throw is amazing. It is actually pretty small, though, so it's not the biggest throw, but I think it can go on the end of the bed, and it'll look good there. Or I can put it, like, under my comforter and kind of have it peek through showing almost like it's a quilt or something. I feel like it could add some fun color to it and kind of, like, take some of all that whiteness away from it and add some really pretty color depth. And then I picked up this pillow from Michaels, um, kind of keeping with that same theme. So I really love this pillow a lot. The only thing is I'm kind of scared that it may not work for my room. So I may just keep this here and I may take one of these pillows with me. But it was actually only $9. They had their 70% off sale of this whole category. So I got a bunch of things from it to kind of go with my style. And then today, I just bought this pillow. And then today, I actually just bought this pillow right here. And it is beautiful. It is the most beautiful mustard, almost really like a, just a beautiful dark yellow. And it was $20 from Target. And I loved it so much. I had a gift card, so I went to a little bit more. All right, staying on the Target train, I got a bunch of little kind of like organizers for that black cart y'all saw and so this one was three dollars and then the, for the two of these they were also three dollars so i wanted to get some different grays and stuff to kind of mix it up a little bit play with colors and i keep it all the same one more in shade and so these are nice all right then next from target i got these lights right here these like little hanging pendant lights and someone's room too i can't forget i think her name's like I don't know, I forgot her name, but she kind of had some pendants in her room, and I really did want some, and at Target, I got lucky, and I found these in matte black. They were actually on sale for only literally $9, and they're even cheaper now, so if y'all want them, go to your Target right now and get them. And so, they actually are not, um, they're battery operated, so just turn them on, turn them off, and so I'm really cool to have some fun with these, and these will probably go right by my bed, just so I can have some extra light. And then also from Target, I got another matte black lamp. And so this one right here, it's really nice actually. It's kind of what I was looking for. And so the nice style. And so it's $19. It was on sale. Kind of has like that um, wireless charging pad right there, which I guess you could use. But I really didn't like it. It goes with the thing that I'm looking for. And so it just works. It's going to tie in everything. All right. And then from Ikea, I got this big boy right here, which is really just called a pegboard. But I feel like to call it the Scatus, Scatus, I don't know. It's really weird, weird words to pronounce, but it was about $16 from Ikea, and it's gonna go right above my desk at school. And so, usually to put in the pegboards, they have some really fun things. So, I got like these, um, this little cup holder or whatever you wanna call it. Not cup holder, like a pencil holder. And then these little shelves, so I can put like more decorations on them. So I got two of them. And then I think you can also go online and find some. And so these are like a dark gray, but I may spray paint them with the spray paint I'm gonna show y'all in just a second. All right, then lastly from Ikea, I got this picture frame right here, which is just a really like simple picture frame. I'll probably put it on the wall or on my desk. I don't know where I'm gonna put it yet. However, it was really simple. It was really cheap. It was on sale for like $3. So I just wanna pick this up. And I'm also gonna spray paint this with the spray paint I got to tie in everything in my room. All right, the first thing I got <laughs> was this star right here that I actually fell in love with. It kind of had like that rustic type of vibe to it, which is still what I'm going for in my room. It was originally $12, 70 percent off, so it was a little under $5. And so I got this right here from Michaels as well. It was originally $12 and really like a little vase or whatever for these little leaves that I got. I'll show y'all more in a second. And so it was a little five dollars as well, same percent off. And another one right here, this was stained glass, which I thought was actually the most beautiful thing ever. And it was actually originally eight dollars, so basically it went down to a little over, um, a little under two fifty. And so this is the most beautiful thing ever. I kind of like it more than the other one, and for it to be so cheap, I like it even more. And I'll probably put another one of these in here. I think it's banana leaf. Then I picked up this little fake succulent right here. It's so cute. I think these rock 60% off and this was $10. So it was about $4 and it's so pretty. I kind of love it. 
I'm really bad with like real plants. <laughs> so I knew I wanted a lot of fake plants to kind of like open the roof up a little bit more, make it look more inviting. And then I also got this little boy here. It's really not a succulent, but it's a little um, plant. It was also on, um, on sale for only $4, so it was 60% off. And so this one's really pretty. I do like it. My mom doesn't like it, but I love it actually. I feel like it feels more real than the other one in my opinion. So it's really cute. And then here's the spray paint that I was telling you guys about. Um, it's really just in color white copper. I feel like I just really wanted that. So I'm gonna be spray painting a lot of things. I got some shelves and stuff on the spray paint just to kind of add a little bit more character to everything and not have everything being so different and more hodgepodge. I wonder if they can kind of tie it together. This was actually on sale for three dollars at my also from Michaels, I got this Stay Sharp sign right here. I really do love it so much. It was also 70% off. So I want to say, um, yeah, it was $4.80, which I do love. It'll go well on my wall. And so it's just really pretty. I think it'll be some good wall art. Lastly from Michaels is, well, is the big boy right here. And it'll catch your reflection. It's this mirror right here. And I want to go on my gallery wall. It was originally $38, but I only got it for $10 which is amazing. It's actually really heavy and sturdy too, so it's like a good, good mirror. And so it kind of reminds me of the mirror that's on that wall right there. I have to show y'all, but I love it so much. And so like I said, only $10, and it'll go on my gallery wall, and it'll just kind of like open a small space up when you kind of have like four mirrors or whatever, and I'll have like light reflecting from it, so. It's all in my head. Y'all just have to see it, but it's all in my head. And so this shelf I got from Walmart, it was about $6 actually. And it's like, I'll just pull it out. This is literally all it is right here. And so I guess some type of good plastic or whatever, but I'm gonna spray paint this and put it up on my wall for kind of my gallery wall. I think I'll put like a few um, succulents or whatever right here or that picture frame. And I think it'll go really well. And so I'm just excited to DIY it for a little magic on. I really just got this little, another little wall hanging right here from Walmart and it was actually on clearance. It was about $7 originally, which was also really good, but I got it for about $3.50. And I love it. I think it's the blue in it that kind of brings it out. And also, how pretty is like that color comparison, that color contrast, I may say. It's honestly the most beautiful thing ever. And so I just feel like this would work really well on the wall, on my whole gallery wall. I just love what happened. All right, so it's in the decor section. I think that's also it for the video. I really have a, basically everything. I think I may get a mini fridge for myself. I definitely need a shower caddy. I don't need a few other things, but other than that, that's kind of like the good bulk of everything. Like I said, everything, all of this was on a budget. I don't think anything was ever full price. And if it was, it wasn't like ridiculously priced or it made sense. The price made sense for everything. So you can definitely do it all on the budget. All right, guys, so that's really it for this video today. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I want to do like college vlogs in college. I'm going to try my hardest. I think college is such a fun experience or at least it looks fun on the internet and so if I actually do enjoy it I do want to show it on here so hope y'all enjoy it and I'll see y'all later.